Oh wow, that's beautiful. <laughs> They ignored the 1%. It's rounding error. Um, so, atom-atom bond. 1.2 times 10 to the minus 20th is the depth of the well. So when this two thing forms, it gives off an energy of 1.2 times 10 to the minus 20th joules. Its bond energy, when it's formed, is 1.2 times 10 to the minus 20th joules. It's negative of that. What about those two atoms? What's the bond energy of those, just those two when they form? Negative 0.5. So there's a negative 0.5 for that. And then I bring this one up. How many more bonds are there? Two more, so that lowers the energy by how much when those two bonds form? Another negative one. There's a bond, negative 0.5. There's another one, negative one. There's another one, negative 1.5. The bond energy for that triatomic molecule, negative 1.5 times 10 to the minus 20 joules, a lower number, a stronger, harder to break apart three atoms that are stuck together than it is, even if they're, each bond is weaker, than it is to break apart two atoms that are stuck together with a slightly stronger bond. There are more bonds and every bond, every two atoms that come together lose that much energy, 0.5. Those two lost 0.5 when they came together. This one comes in, forms two more bonds. Each one of those loses 0.5. So the lower bond energy, B, the triatomic molecule, negative 1.5 is a lower bond energy than negative 1.2. Just adding them up. Any questions about that one? I think that you've done this in DL. Here's one I don't think you have quite done. Maybe you have, but maybe not. So, here's, yeah, I guess you can see all the answers. Um, suppose that each pair of near neighbor atoms in this solid right here has this potential energy. So remember these potential energies are always pair potentials is another way of putting it. They are for two atoms. Any two atoms. So here's the potential energy for two of those atoms. When I stick together all of these how many are there? One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five. Thirty-six atoms. When I, and there's also 36 atoms here, I guess, the same number. When I stick together 36 atoms here, each one has six neighbors around it. How many bonds here? Well, let me just finish it. Uh, that potential energy is for any two. This potential energy right here is for any two atoms in this Solid. These are both solids. Uh, which solid gives up the most bond energy when you condense it from a gas? Which solid gives up the most bond energy when you condense it from a gas? That's my question for you. 